there's something that you need to have. It is compulsory. It is compulsory. Okay? Especially if you're going anywhere this December and you're going to Nigeria and you have your pounds calling. You just say, ah, you know, let me just send to my accounts in Nigeria. Do you understand? Just send me into my account for selling to Naira immediately. I had this problem not too long ago, actually, when I was in Nigeria and I was unable to convert the monies. I just bought I just Johnny, Johnny just come. Like you can go to someone now on the street or you know in the shop and they will they will chop your money. And at that time I really wish I could just go on the app, open it, convert, but yeah, start spending and start blowing the naira. But unfortunately we didn't have it, but now we do. Go and tap the app, go and get the app. So that when you go to Nigeria, if you need to just convert dollars into the naira, the sterling into naira, transfer go just do it. Transfer go just do it. Will enter in the jumping in the account now, it's so fast. Somebody said, Pray, girl. So, if you need to send cool cash, cool, cool, cool cash, do like cool cash style, we have transfer go here that they will just so sharply, so quickly, it will jump into the account. Somebody said, Pray, girl. So, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, if you need to send the money, make sure that you what get your transfer go app so that you can start spending the cool cash now one video that South African girl oh, all the Nigerian girls they just like money idiots why would you not why why should we not like money and we must talk about Nigerians I don't know what was the obsession with Nigerians I know we're fabulous but still like you want us to be broke I mean well, I don't want to hurt my man my man for money idiots <laughs> idiots I be I'm the baby everyone I'm the baby I am just the baby. Baby, 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 I'm, I'm just the baby. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. I really have the audacity. That crazy, I'm actually so bad. I really left you not here. I really left you. I said, go to hell. What's happening and there's a few changes. That's why I mean, I'm ghost from here. I've left you here because I've got things to do. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, <laughs> me and Z moved into our house and honestly, it has been, every time I walk around my house, I just feel like it is insane. From where I was coming from, this is insane. <laughs> I have so much help from you guys and like my following and everything like it led me to this point here so i feel like it's like new beginnings new beginnings is happening right now and i'm just so in love the way i feel like about myself there's this power that i exuberate out like i just use power and strength and confidence like and if i ever had confidence before it's times 10 now as i in the town in the city you get me we're all around the second thing is um what was the second thing? I was gonna tell you something. You don't know nothing. Let me tell you something. My music. Okay, so my music, it, like I said the last video, because I think some people think I'm actually like, I'm bluffing. <laughs> but my music is actually really close, which makes me really like, I'm quite anxious. I'm just like, oh my God, people are gonna freaking see me singing like, what if they think it's shit? <laughs> so I have a bit of nerves and I'm a bit like, oh, please. I hope that it just goes really well. Like, cause this is my first ever, you know, announcement as an artist. So people try to just keep me in this box. Like they won't like things that are not to do with like being a, a joke. You want me to be a joke, a clown every day. You want me to be a joker, a clown, making jokes and shit? Yeah, that's my personality, but, you know, there's a lot more to me than just being a goofy person. No, like, dating, like, dating as in, like, talking, in a talking stage, right? The way my mentality, the way, the life I've seen, right? <laughs> there's something so different about the way I approach relationships or, like, dating right now. You can see through the shit in one second. One question I want to start with is, 
why do you bother? Like, why do you want to waste someone's time? Like, it's always, it's so flabbergasting that a man will feel like he don't have nothing else to do with his life other than sit and waste a female's time. Why? They're doing all they can just to get with you, just so that they can they can open your, your nyash. You're really spending your time, your precious time on this earth to make sure that you can just sleep with as many people as possible. Are you not crazy? Wake up and open your leg for all the girls to see. Where I don't, I won't explain. No. If I, if you don't get it the first time, I don't feel the need to go out of my way to explain to you how to treat me at my big age, at your big age. I must not tell you, yeah, come, but like, you have to, you have to hug me at one thirty. Make sure you are the one that cook nice breakfast at least once. Why? If someone's not showing you all those things, especially if you're someone who is like your love language is, you know, acts of service. I don't know, it's acts of service and love with money. <laughs> and if you're not bringing anything that makes sense, carry your bag and go. It's not by force. And you know why it's not by force? When you get, when you hustle and you also, you also your life away. All you do is freaking hustle the it's very very easy for you to throw people away because if you're doing everything for yourself and you're working hard when they when they leave it's not like you're depending i'm not depending on anyone so whether you're there or not it makes no difference like you need to show me that there is a difference when if i don't see the difference like without having to coach you through it then you can sir please carry your bag and go like i'm the crazy mom Maybe I'm the crazy. Let's <laughs> um, Asha Kiss concert. I'm very excited for that. Can I just say, I haven't learned the words and I'm going to be singing everything, anything, anyhow. And you can't do anything to me. Why don't you have something good within you? I will say, you know what? Let me treat this girl like an angel. Let me treat like this girl like a damsel. You know, you just be wasting people's time. Just dare to waste people's time. You have to be careful. These these men are actually animals. These men are actually mad. They will sit down there and waste your time just because of vagina, just because they want to open your 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 <laughs> your yash. Some of them would die for the yash. They would die. They would collapse by the yash. But all your body will be shaking. Are you have you got mental problem? Have you got mental problem? Hey! One minute, if I start seeing your stupidity, if I start seeing your rubbish, oh yeah, get out. <laughs> get out. I don't want you to near me, you animal. Now I have zero patience, zero tolerance. Yes. That's your own cup of tea. That's your palava. As for me, I'm ready to chop my husband's money. What the hell? You people want to say, suffer on your own and keep Nigerian women name out of everybody. I have to talk about Nigerian. Why? Why? Why are we always at the tip of the tongue? You can't rest. I don't know whether they want to collect these Yoruba boys. Collect them. It's okay. They are already, they are already treating us like poo. Anyway, <laughs> they are already treating us like poos so like it's not a fight there's enough yoruba men to go around because they do it daily so and i mean it's not generalizing like all of them but <laughs> buckle up with your seat belt to deal with the yoruba man yoruba man is not easy you see how they stand out from everybody when a Yoruba guy with his mates, they are maybe going to do traditional wedding or they are doing birthday and they all wear traditional clothes together. If you see the power that is oozing from the corner, you just want to, 
you want to fall down you just go and pick your bad guy just free willingly you must pray at least one year fasting to say god i'm not top 10 it's not that they're top 10 you know the banter the banter is mad somebody somewhere does not understand oh that's so bad <laughs> right now guys i love my ass my ass is lovely you know sometimes i just sit down there you know you are bringing a tv tomorrow i'm gonna have a tv in the ass to be here right now wow sometimes i just can't take it in god loves me that much it's unreal but yeah i'm about to go to bed now guys but yeah, I shall see you in my next video. Let's see.